Welcome back. We're going to be continuing kind of our calm, pleasant week that we've had with the exception of some extra heat heading into this upcoming weekend. Right now out there, pretty calm, quiet morning. We're going to be potentially seeing just a handful of showers making their way through this morning, but probably the most part, most of us going to be remaining dry. 62 out there right now feels like 62. We have a little bit of a breeze coming out of the south and that southerly wind is really what's going to help us warm things up as we head into the next couple of days. But today will be kind of our buffer day to still enjoy these more comfortable temperatures out there right now. Still kind of riding the line between the 50s and 60s, 59 degrees for Wasika Albert Lee, 62 for here in Mankato like we saw and then just a little warmer out near Redwood Falls Marshall at 67 and 68 degrees around our country. We're kind of seeing a period of some quieter weather and overall this summer we've seen a lot of active weather, but finally getting a little bit of a break for that as we head into this upcoming weekend. We do have this smaller system in more central United States and the kind of the tail end of that could be impacting us just a little bit. But like I mentioned, other than a few pop up showers here and there, we're really not looking at a whole lot of rain today and then maybe our next rain chance as we get closer into our Saturday out there right now, though, we'll see a decent amount of cloud coverage as the day progresses. We'll likely see a lot of those clouds start to uh, go away and we'll see a little more sunshine um, for the second half of the day. Now I did mention we're looking at mostly dry conditions throughout this weekend, but next week is when we could be seeing that active weather pattern kind of returning back to our area, particularly Monday. We could be seeing some more organized weather, some thunderstorms and things like that. And then again later on in the week. But keep in mind, that's a little ways away. It's really hard to nail down those exact details quite yet. As for this actual weekend, though, we're really only looking at Saturday for those higher chances of rain, but still a relatively low chance of rain compared to what we've been seeing recently. Now, one thing that is going to be affecting us a bit this weekend is the humidity. These dew points going to be still fairly comfortable today in the mid 60s. We'll be in that extra deodorant category before warming up into that sweaty, icky, yucky, not going to necessarily love it outside uh, low 70s for those dew points on Saturday. And then we continue to heat things up as we increase that humidity for Sunday mid 70s and especially our more rural, more agricultural areas could be seeing a bit more humidity pushing us into that Antarctica sounds nice category for those dew points. Here's that extended forecast today, kind of a mix of sunshine and clouds that continues through the weekend Sunday looking like the hottest and most humid with the most sunshine as well. We'll see those temperatures rising into the upper 80s and into the lower 90s for a few Monday and Tuesday. Like I had mentioned that next chance of thunderstorms and then we could be seeing another more active weather pattern for the end of the week as those temperatures dip back closer to normal. That's all for weather. We'll be right back.